just say no to big belly garbage can so um please don't destroy them i mean it's at least at least it's a garbage can um but uh i can understand people wanting to destroy them though um i think there's just something there's something really mean about the big belly garbage cans um plus they break really easy um it's really i, I would have broke the mouth of a big belly garbage can that is i um i found a i found a bag of food from the westfield mall in san francisco it was in a brown bag from i think panda express not like it wasn't like a ridiculously large brown paper bag it really wasn't after i after i finished the chinese food i put it into the um it's a big belly garbage can and um and it broke i broke the mouth it, it was too much for it um a red light came on and, and i couldn't and i couldn't get it out um because that's the way the big belly garbage cans are designed they're designed so you can't get things out of the garbage can that's why i say they're really they're really mean-spirited um, um you may remember when you were a kid reaching your hand all the way up inside the vending machines trying to trying to get a soda out or something like that yeah i did that when i was a kid and i never could do it well i could understand i could understand putting that kind of protection on the vending machine you're selling something but why 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 would they why would they want to engineer a garbage can so that people can't take things out of the garbage can um I've been, I've been walking around trashing the big belly garbage cans for a couple of years now. Um, the first reason I had for, for for disliking the big belly garbage cans was that um, was that you, a person, a hungry person, couldn't reach their hand inside the garbage can to try to get food out of it. Um, if you don't think that food is being wasted in San Francisco, good food is being wasted, being thrown out, I beg to differ. Um, I remember one time I was, um, I was starving, I was, um, I was, and I was, I was on my way to Subway actually, um, but, um, I had to wait for the stoplight to change, so, um, while I was waiting for the stoplight to change and starving, I, I reached my hand inside the garbage can there to see if there was any food, what was in, what was on top of the garbage can, and I couldn't, I couldn't freaking believe it because it was a really good, um, roast, uh, Turkey club, it was a turkey club, turkey bacon club sandwich, like half half of half of a club sandwich. Like, like someone didn't finish their sandwich at lunch and just threw it out. Um, big belly garbage cans also they're designed so that they're designed so that if a person wants to leave their 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 unfinished meal on top of the garbage can, they can't because because they're slanted on top. They're curved at the top, and they have a, and they put a solar panel on the top of the big belly garbage can, making it making making it feel like like somebody like somebody might feel like they're they maybe doing something maybe the wrong thing by leaving their food for a hungry person on top of the big belly garbage can. <laughs> I'm asking San Francisco to say absolutely no, no way to big belly garbage cans. Um, It was about three months ago. I was in, I was walking around Union Square, and I couldn't believe it. But I, I really could because because I've, I've been talking about the problem. What if somebody actually accidentally threw out their keys or their their wallet in the garbage can? They wouldn't be able to reach into it. Um, and I couldn't believe it because I was walking I was walking around Union Square. It was about three or so months ago, and and. It was a Sutter and uh, it was on Sutter. I don't remember. Anyway, um, it was near the Apple Store, and 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 there was a, and there was a driver there, a woman. She was she was like she asked me she like hey, do you know how to get into this garbage can? Do you know how to open this garbage can? And I just I just accidentally threw out my ID. She threw out her ID in the garbage can by accident, and she couldn't get it out. She, I called 311. 
I called through one to see if there was, if they had somebody like a, um, um, somebody on call in case, in case something accidentally gets thrown out in these garbage cans. Um, but she, they didn't have anything. And, that, and that's, that's really a problem because they're designed so people can't get things out of the garbage can if they throw something out. Um, you just can't reach your hand in, period. I'm, uh, I'm here at the store. So please just say no to big old garbage cans. My name is Matt Ford. That's Ford like the car. 555.